guys and welcome back to my channel ignore my dirty windshield i need to clean my windshield next time i go get gas but we are starting another shop with me at tj max a marshall's video this week um i'm not gonna lie it's been a while since i've been in my stores so i'm probably gonna have lots of new finds hopefully anyways <laughs> fingers crossed i know all the holiday stuff is starting to pop up in stores so I'm hoping for some really great finds this week. As usual, I'm starting out my Marshalls and Sterling. And then I'm going to go to the TJ Maxx that's here in Sterling. And then probably tomorrow, I will end up at the Marshalls where I live. But yeah, wish me good finds this week. Maybe I'll be able to find those Moschino Toy Bear uh, perfumes this week in my TJ Maxx and Marshalls. One of them. I would be so freaking happy if I found those. But anyways, I'm going to go ahead and go inside and let's get this video started. I'm so I only excited. found the GlossierBomb.com in my stores. This is the coconut one for $7.99. Uh, Travel says of this got a turquoise summer limited edition perfume. It's a $9.99 for that one. I don't see fragrance notes on it. Oh, we have this from Chapstick, the limited edition pumpkin pie fall scented one for just $2.99 for three of them. That's a really good deal. This is new to my store. This is the NARS Summer Solstice Cheek Duo. Looks like that. It's going for $29.99. Here's a new shade in lip gloss holographic um, from Glossier. It's for $7.99. We have in the eyeshadow palette section this um, multi-finish 4-in-1 face palette from the lip bar. It has highlighter, blush, face, and contour powder, supposedly. It's $4.99. Here's an amazing find. I found the Urban Decay Wild Greens palette. <laughs> Look at the color story. It's $16.99 for this palette. I'm not surprised that it's showing up here. I feel like it wasn't that big of a hit. It was just an okay palette that people talked about. So you have from what well this looks like it's from the same about bell collection but it also looks like it's in the dollar tree packaging <laughs> looks like it's 3.99 for that also we're finding the elf camo powder foundation for just 4.99 they do have various shades in it there's some so i have a brush is popping up this is the brush and contour one for 5.99 so have the eyeshadow and highlighter brush from Zoeva. It's $6.99. And I have the petite face brush. Looks really pretty. It looks like a brush. Is. This is $4.99. We have some brushes from Makeup Revolution. Is the Neon Heat Brush Collection. I don't remember seeing this. It's $9.99. I'm from Brioche, the Farewell Frizz Smoothing Conditioner. Going for $16.99. This little mini size. There's two of them. Of the hemp's love out loud limited edition is juicy pineapple and creamy coconut for $3.99 just travel size versions this is an amazing find this is the Briojo superfoods matcha and apple replenishing shampoo it is $14.99 for this now this from soap and glory the body buttercream and sugar it says freshly squeezed sweet lime fragrance crush sugar crush is the scent for $5.99 interesting body butter I have another one from hemp's the happy collection sweet pineapple and honey melon going for $12.99 they also have the hemp's pink centron and mimosa flower for $12.99 we have some holiday from philosophy the snow globe one shower gel for $10.99 the usual price <clears throat> also have this from hemp's it's the sugar cane and papaya no price but i'm assuming it's the normal 12.99 that the others are a lot of hemp's this is the pink pomelo and himalayan sea salt for 12.99 lots of hemp's in my stores today although i'm not seeing the uh peppermint one that people have been finding i have a miniature size of the vanilla sweet fig from philosophy i hear this is a favorite scent among people it's 5.99 for the travel size version have this giant philosophy chocolate chip cookies shower gel they go for $19.99 for these big ones they last forever though we have the minis of the sweet vanilla fig hand cream also $2.99 just found a couple of these from glossy the priming moisture balance it's the oil control gel creams for oily skin or primer for oily skin for $12.99 have this from bad habit the chill out 
hydrating mist going for $4.99. Lots of Morphe 2 to keep a calm facial mist and we'll clear things up clarifying and serum, which is $5.99. This facial mist is $4.99. Did you hear they filed for chapter, they might be filing for chapter 11 bankruptcy? And that's probably why we've seen so much Morphe in stores and now Jaclyn Cosmetics in stores too. And lip bar, because they're also owned by Morphe. Another bad habit product, the Palm Reader Hand Cream for $3.99. So another Morphe 2 skincare here, the Detox Face Mask for $4.99. Like they have this little Christmas set at my stores at my Marshalls here in Sterling too. It's the mini sleeping mask set from Laneige. It's with the water sleeping mask, the lavender one, and then the Seco one for redness. And it's going for $24.99 some perfumes from the good scent they have the sandalwood rose which is creamy white sandalwood and pink rose hips <laughs> they're going for $12.99 for that one and then they have the good scent enchanting potion which is peony wicked white peach and chilling melon it's $9.99 that's part of the Halloween collection and I see they got more of the Le Mans Gourmand perfumes on. This is the Le De Coco for $12, no, $17.99. These used to be $19.99, so the Dumbo ones. So I see this body spray from the Good Scent, the Let's Get Figgy with Fresh Fig, White Peach, and Caramelized Sugar. It does smell good. It's $5.99. I have this from the Briogeo, the Healthy Hair Wonders. It looks like it comes with the Don't Despair Repair Deep Conditioning Mask. The oil, the treatment oil. The Be Gentle, Be Kind, like a miniature mask. <laughs> and then the Farewell Frizz. I'm assuming these are all minis for $29.99. I have this from um, Moschino, the I Love Love. I heard this is a dupe for the uh, Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue perfume. I could be wrong, but that's what I heard. It's $39.99. I have this from Julia Has a Gun, Mad Madame for $79.99, expensive, but this is an expensive perfume. We have this from Burberry, it's the Burberry Br Rhythm for her, for $12.99. I'm not sure how this is, I've never smelled it before. Also have this super cute, like, gift set of the Onyx Bathhouse uh, scrubs. They have the, they're going for $7.99 for the minis. They have the Snowberry, Winter Blossom, Vanilla Almond, and the marshmallow in here they're all the all of the um winter uh christmas scents i couldn't think of the word all the christmas scents here that's a good price and it would make a great gift for somebody who loves to do self-care so this little set from elf the super skincare mini trio from elf which comes with their super clarify their super tone and their super hydrate and it's only $5.99 this will make a great stocking stuffer this little set from Mario but ask you it's the facial spray plus it comes with like a little mini candle I didn't even know they did candles this is $9.99 for that this from Biogio the scalp revival stimulating massager for $7.99 I have a scalp massager and they are so good I really like them it's officially Christmas in all the stores, I think, now. I've seen other people posting Christmas stuff. <laughs> Look at these cute little Christmas shot glasses from Star Wars. They're going for $7.99. But the main reason I did it is because they have these Joanna Parker mugs. That I know people like Joanna Parker. This is the Mr. and Mrs. Claus mug set, which is super cute. Going for $12.99. They also have these really cute mugs. This one from Corksicle, which I know is a pretty popular band. Brand can't talk today. It's twelve ninety nine. Cute is that little Grinch? How cute is that little Grinch cookie thing down? Cookie jar down there. So cute. Let's zoom into it. I like the Grinch. Oh my God. We also have this set here. They have the little Joanna Parker salt and pepper shakers. Here's this Jingle Bells and Ho 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 from Ray Don. And the frosty hat that's also from Ray Dunn Cookie Jar. Look at this cute little snow Mickey. I really like that one. There's another Joanna Parker. I duck the holes. Feliz Fiestas. <laughs> and there's a Jack Skeleton Cookie Jar too with a hat on it. 
And there's a Mickey and Minnie salt and pepper shaker. Super cute stuff this year for Christmas. Check in the candle section just to see if there's any Christmas popping up here yet. I don't see anything. The only thing I've seen was this. This is technically fall, but these candles smell so good. <laughs> mm. Especially this one, it really does smell like warm apple cider. And it smells really, really strong cold. So I feel like it would be really, really strong um, and warm too. But it's $19.99 for this giant candle. <laughs> and hello Christmas. It's late no matter what holiday. There's gnomes. I don't know what's with the gnomes. <laughs> I'm not a gnome person. And it looks like it's pastel for Christmas too. That must just be the thing this year. I do think this little Yeti snowman dude looks really cute. <laughs> More gnomes. Like, literally this whole table is gnomes. I've seen one thing though. Hold on. So this is the one thing I love. <laughs> the Grinch, of course. I love the Grinch. Look, his heart lights up. Oh, $24.99. I really like him. Hmm. He's so cute. Okay. Okay, I'm out of my Marshalls now. So, I did pick up quite a few things. Y'all seen there was quite a few finds in there. I was shocked, but not shocked to find the Urban Decay Wild Greens palette. Because that wasn't really talked about much on um, YouTube. I've seen a couple reviews, but then you see nobody pass the reviews really featuring it in their videos. Um, it just wasn't a hit for Urban Decay. So it wasn't a surprise to see that one in my Marshalls. But there was some pretty good finds. I finally found the Glossier Bomb.com. I've never seen any of those in my stores. I end up leaving it um, just because it's the coconut one. <laughs> I'm hoping to find the cherry, the cherry one is the one that I'm looking for. And I know I've seen people find the cherry one in stores before. So, just waiting to see if maybe it's in one of my other stores this week. You never know. And I did not find that Moschino Toy Bear perfume. It's going to drive me nuts until I find it. But I did find a Juliet. Um, not a perfume, perfume. So, that was interesting. I'm gonna go ahead and go into the the um what I bought this week. So the first thing I picked up was this from Penrose. It's the Wild Child Udo Perfume Spray, and it is Gardenia, Jasmine, and Frangipani. And it is very much a white floral perfume. You really get that Gardenia the most, I think. So this is probably something I'll get more use out of in the springtime next year. But I am glad to have it. It was $7.99. And if you don't like white florals, um, or you don't like gardenia, jasmine, or Frank Pini or florals at all, you're not going to like this one because it is very much a floral perfume. You have to like florals to like it. And I do love a floral perfume, but more in the springtime. So this one will be put away. And then I usually carry these little travel size ones in my purse. I just keep one that's appropriate for each season. That way, if I'm out and about and I want to freshen up, I have a, a travel size perfume in my purse to freshen up with. So that's what I do with these little travel size ones, if you're wondering, just in case. You can also take them on vacation. I do the same thing, too. I take all of my travel size ones on vacation. That way, I just have so many different scents to choose from, too. And um, another thing I got was... From Escada. I love those Escada perfumes. So <laughs> I gotta pick it up whenever I see one. So I found this Escada Turquoise Summer. It's a limited edition of perfume. It was $9.99 for it. And I really love the smell. It's like fruity. It's a very a summery scent. Um it's probably something I'll wear, like I said, in the summertime. It's not really a fall or a winter scent for me, but I will put it with my other travel size perfumes. And like I said, in the summertime, it might go in my purse to freshen up with um, when I'm out and about or when I go on vacation. Or I would take it with me on vacation if I was going to like someplace tropical, like Florida. I know that's not really tropical, but there's palm trees. So 
Maybe I should state that. If I go somewhere that has palm trees, I would take this with me. Because it just makes me think of summer and tropical paradise. So, yes. I'm really glad I picked this up. This is probably my favorite out of all the ones i picked up so far. But I just love Ascada fragrances in general. <clears throat> Last thing I picked up, which I do really like, is this curation by The Good Scent. This is another one of the Halloween ones. This is the Enchanting Potion. It says it's Enchanting Peony, Wicked White Peach, and Chilling Melon. It was only $9.99 for this one. I was surprised because there was another one in there by The Good Scent, and it was $12.99. But I didn't really care that much for the smell of that one. But I did like the smell of this one. And it smells, um, <clears throat> let me get a sniff again. It smells mainly, mainly like peony. So if you like a sweet peony, it smells like a sweet peony perfume. There's probably maybe a hint of peach and melon, but not really. <laughs> if I'm being honest, it just smells like a sweet peony perfume. So it's not too, too floral. That sweetness really cuts the floral for me. It's a really good perfume. Would I consider it a Halloween-y perfume? Maybe not. This is probably something I would wear in the summertime. <clears throat> and if it was still warm in the beginning of fall, then I would probably still wear it then too. But it is very much a sweet peony perfume. So if you like peony scents, I think you would like this. If you don't like peony scents, you might still like it because it's very much a sweet one. I think it's getting the sweetness from the white peach and that melon in there. But I really like it. And I'm glad to have it to add to my collection. Because apparently I've been collecting these Halloween-y scents from the good scent. The body sprays and the perfumes. So I hope I find more perfumes. I'm sure there's more. Since I have like four body sprays from them. I'm sure there's got to be some perfumes <laughs> to go with it. So there must be at least two more of these perfumes. That hopefully I'll be able to find. <clears throat> Anyways. <sighs> Let's move on to TJ Maxx. I hope they have as good of finds as I found in my Marshalls. But from my last video, which my last video posted last week was an old video. I did that before I even went on vacation. And I wanted to post it while I was gone from vacation. But then I never got around to editing it before vacation. There was just so much to do. I just... I didn't have time to edit it to schedule it the post while I was gone. So I ended up just taking the week off because I was sick anyways. <clears throat> so it was an older video. But from that video, the TJ Maxx was better than my Marshalls. So we'll see if that still holds true today. So let's go to TJ Maxx and see what good finds they might have there for us. I have to say that my TJ Maxx is doing better than my Marshall still. They already have the holiday tables set out with all the holiday gift sets on it. They have some from Onyx Bad House with the little Santa hats. Here's a crime shop, Hello Kitty. Mario Badasco, which I showed you in um, <coughs> Marshall's. They have this sitting on the table from Philosophy. Season of Snow. It is $17.99 for Snow Angels, Snow Fairy, Snow Globe, and Shimmering Snow Lace. I have this cute little set from Onyx Bathhouse. It comes with a sugar cookie balm. There's a lip balm, a body scrub, a body lotion, and a bath soak. This is $12.99. That's not bad for that. I have this from Raw Sugar Kids. They're bath bombs. Strawberry vanilla scented for $3.99. We also have this from Vita Bath. Bath Fizzies. This is Pomegranate Bellini Blush. And this has Epsom salt in it, which is good. It's $5.99 for that one. How cute are these reusable makeup removing cloths? It's like a dupe for um, makeup eraser. Looks like a little watermelons for $6.99 for these. It looks like you get four of them. I have this little set from Brioche that we've seen before. The deep conditioning mask and the moisture hair mask. <clears throat> there are $7.99 for these like deluxe size samples. So I have this mist set from Mario Badascu for $16.99. It says it's the mini mist collection. This cute set from Soap and Glory. It's 
it is a huge box. It doesn't really say what's inside. But I'm assuming it comes with a bunch of shower stuff. Over here we have a bunch of bath bombs on this table. How cute is this one from the crumb shop? It's the Hello Kitty one. It says it's elimination. Peppermint, peppermint cream aroma. <clears throat> $4.99. Not bad. We have this one from the Chrome Shop and Hello Kitty. Strawberry vanilla and apple pie. These are limited edition too for $8.99. We have this set, the Hydro and Repair set. Scalp and hair mask kit from Briogeo for $16.99 for this. We have this from Dr. Jart. It is the Seco Rescue Kit. Soothe, repair, strengthen for sensitive dry skin. <clears throat> Looks like it comes with a bunch of minis of the Seco Pear line. For $19.99. This is a very popular line from them. Now this from Onyx Bathhouse is the Holiday Glow Scrubs. Let it glow body scrub and the let's get cracking. It is $9.99 for these two. Remember the perfumes, the Viva La Juicy Go Gold Couture for $14.99. <clears throat> they also have this Burberry Body Tender for $3.99. Here's this bro belly for women for $29.99. Then Ariana Grande's Thank You Next for $24.99. Also this one from Ariana Grande. Sweet Light Candy for $24.99. They also have the Burberry Brit Rhythm here. I don't know what the price is on this. It's, there's no price. <laughs> one of these Royal Sugar Kids Fizzy Bath Bombs. So this is in Watermelon Lemonade. Which I imagine that smells really good for $3.99. <clears throat> they also have this single like ornament from philosophy the snow angel uh shower gel for $5.99 and they have this thing for the hair that everybody's been doing with the, <laughs> the curl set to curl your hair overnight with this big thing it's going for $6.99 for that big thing for this white wild and say by the collection lip gloss it looks like it's in the dollar tree packaging <laughs> $3.99 for that. I have a bunch of the Glossier lip gloss. It looks like it's just the clear shade for $7.99. There's a Florence by Mills concealer. Looks like a deeper shade. Going for $3.99. They also have the Glossier Brow Flick in black for $6.99. We have the Glossier Solar Paint. This is in Ray, which I believe is the lighter shade. Going for $9.99. They also have it in Heat which I believe is a deeper shade. A bunch of these e.l.f. ride or die lip balms. Over here they have that Mighty Mint one. I really love the formula of these, but getting them out of this tube is a pain in the butt. You really have to squeeze with all your might to get them out, but they're $2.99. The formula is really good though. More of the Capri lip glosses popping up. This is the pineapple one for $6.99. The new brand Hard Candy. This is the Hard Candy at Marilyn Monroe. Looks like a liquid lipstick and rose kisses. For $2.99. Looks like a really pretty, like, rosy, mauve pink. There's another solar plate paint. This is in Flare. Maybe this is the medium shade for $9.99. Oh, I found a tar eyeshadow palette for myself. This is Rainforest of the Sea for $24.99. Lots of Anastasia palettes of Riviera and the subculture. Both going for $19.99. The Glossier Coconut Bomb.com for $7.99. Hope I find other scents soon. So this from Hard Candy, the Glow Dome Highlighter. It looks like it's for deeper skin tones. Going for $2.99. We have the Hip Dot and JoJo Siwa palette for $6.99 in stores. It says it's a pigment and glitter palette. They're also getting more of the Sephora S Clean foundations back in stock for the holidays. I don't know what the price is. There's no price on this one. Also got these from Wet and Wild. This is from the Save by Bella Collection too. The Face Duo for $3.99. I do like these. These were pretty good. I have them in my collection. This from Soap and Glory. The Clean On Me Creamy Shower Gel for $5.99. Seeing people find this and I've been wondering about it. It's a banana foam cleanser from Tony Moly and Minions for $4.99 interesting so sweet you want to eat jam packs with delicious banana that will gently cleanse and then soften without drying or irritating your skin and this from glossier the super pure niacinamide plus zinc serum for 12.99
There's some soap and glory they call it fruity body scrub for $4.99. Passion fruit daiquiri from Philosophy for $10.99. They also have a Santa Hat and Senior in the Christmas scents. The Holly Jolly, Holly and Jolly scent. It is $10.99 also, the usual price. So I have this from Philosophy, the Snow Globe for $10.99. Now this is from Hemp's. The minty and mellow peppermint body moisturizer for $12.99. This is the one I was looking for. It has a uh, CBD in it, so it's supposed to be like naturally calming. From this Milani, it's the rose butter lip mask for $15.99. That's kind of expensive if you ask me for Milani. But okay. Super cute Christmas Onyx Bath House Foaming Body Scrub and Oh Snap Gingerbread Crumbs and Shea Butter for $5.99. <coughs> They also have this one from Tony Moly and the Minions. It's a peach sugar body scrub. I'm not sure how this is. I've never tried it before. It's $4.99 for that. I've seen this before from Spa Carry, the cotton candy exfoliating sugar scrub. Sugar scrub. It's going for $5.99. They also have one that's hyaluronic acid, one that's collagen. And then this one that's sweet coconut. So I'm out of my TJ Maxx. You can't see because of Van Park. <laughs> right in front of my car. So it's covering up the TJ Maxx emblem. But TJ Maxx, once again, ahead of times of my Marshalls. I don't know why I'm so surprised. They used to be behind. They used to be behind. It used to be my Marshalls was where it's at. But my TJ Maxx already got holiday tables set up three holiday tables with like gift sets on it and everything so i don't know where marshall's at but <laughs> maybe they're enjoying halloween i would like to say that but no because they already have christmas stuff out they do have their halloween stuff at the front of the store but i didn't really look at it um and tj maxx i just went to the makeup and body care by the time i looked over all of that i was feeling hot for some reason <laughs> tired so i just end up leaving i didn't even go to the candles or to the decor to see if there's christmas stuff up yet i will go there next week just to see but i did pick up a few things and i thought i would just let you know what i got first thing i got was this viva la juicy gold couture juicy couture eau de parfum and you guys, this smells so good. I love Viva La Juicy fragrances anyways. But this one is so good. It's only a half a fluid ounce. So it is like that big. And the cap is the rest of the box. But I have so many perfumes that I really don't need a giant one. Unless it's one that I really, really love. Like um, Ariana Grande's Cloud. I think I need that in the big size. Because I'm on my one ounce size or 1.7 ounce size whatever that smaller size is is almost gone i'm barely getting anything out now from it because i loved it that much and this one oh my gosh this one just smells so good i feel like this is a great fall scent it just feels smells warm and cozy and it has that typical perfume scent it just smells warm and cozy to me. That's how I describe this scent. I really, really like it. But I love, I love Juicy Couture scents. I love the, uh, the first one I ever bought from them was the Viva La Juicy La Rose. And that one's really good too. But that one's more strong because of the rose scent. It has like that bubbly note that's like really strong up front and bright and in your face. So that one I would describe as more of like a spring or a summertime scent. This is like a date night scent or something you would wear in the fall. I would definitely wear this on a date night. I mean, your man would probably love this. But I have never smelled the gold couture so I'm really liking this. I feel like this is probably going to be something where I use up the whole bottle and may need the larger size. That's how much I'm really loving this scent. But yeah, I got that. I didn't show this on camera, but I did get these Revolution and Barbie no nail drama. The it's just some nail clippers. I want to get. I wanted to get a nail clipper to keep in my purse to have on the go for. In case I break a nail, God forbid, I have something so I can clip it. That way it doesn't break further and ruin my fingers like this one. 
<laughs> so I got just a nail clipper and this is a cute Barbie one so yeah got that it was only $2.99 for that <clears throat> and then last thing I picked up is what I was looking for this hemp's um minty and mellow peppermint herbal body moisturizer it is a uh, Christmas scent I believe this is from last year <clears throat> or the year before but I did smell it it is very minty and it does smell mellow um it says it has uh hemp seed oil in it and 600 milligrams of cbd so it is supposed to be like calming to your skin so if you have really sensitive skin or you have like rosé i heard if you have rosacea that cbd really does help calm it down some so maybe if you have sensitive skin or something or you have get redness in your skin easy this might help calm it down it was 12.99 for that and it does smell like peppermint so if you don't like like a peppermint scent then you might not like this but i do feel like it was more of like a sweeter peppermint so i am excited to have this for the winter time so i'm probably gonna use this in the winter time only um but yeah that is everything that I picked up from my TJ Maxx. Um, I didn't get anything else. <laughs> I am going to wait and go tomorrow after I work out at the gym to the um, Marshalls where I live in Leesburg for my last stop. And hopefully we'll have some great finds there too. But we'll see. <clears throat> so I'm in the Marshalls where I live. And I found these Estila National Treasure Convertible Color lip and cheek creams this is quad number two there's a look at the shades for $6.99 yeah this from rachel zoe and lorac the ultra ego golden air lip set seriously chic it's $19.99 when i assume it's golden now this from Steeler, the treasure island all-in-one putty trio for $7.99 comes with a bronzer a highlighter and a blush the bronzer is number one, the highlighter is kitten, and the blush is peony. Looks like that, I suppose. I also have this NARS Summer Solstice Cheek Dough here in this Marshalls also for $29.99. I have this from Mally, the Get Cheeky Brightening Blush Trio, and just peachy. Going for $5.99. Here's a look at the shades. And they got the Jacqueline Cosmetics face palette in here. Winter Sun with Royal Icing, Snow Bunny, and Avalanche. Going for $9.99. We have this from Dragon Beauty. It is the face pressed powder palette. I just recognize it from the face. There's no price because the box is missing. But interesting to finally see that in my stores. They're open again. Lash Freak here. The Freaky Volume Mascara for $12.99. I still think that wand is so weird, but this is my first time seeing it in my stores. I have this one from Lancome, the Virtuous Precious Cells Mascara in black for $14.99. Interesting to see this Milani mascara here. This was raved on, I think, TikTok, the highly rated anti-gravity mascara. It went TikTok viral there for a minute. It's only $4.99 here, and it is an intense black, so interesting i have like a little gift set of the elf skin holy hydration line i really do love this line for my face it's really good if you have dry skin it's going for 9.99 which would make a great gift i have this little set of the mario badascu's the mini mist for 12.99 that is the set i've seen before of the mini sleeping mask set from laneige going for $24.99. have the Laneige Chica Sleeping Mask for $19.99. This is a full size one. They also have the Lip Sleeping Mask in Mint Chocolate for $19.99. Almost thought that said $49.99. It's $19.99. have this from Dr. Jart, the Sika Pear Sleeping Mask. It's $29.99 for that. I have a lot of the bad habits skincare also the palm reader daily dose multivitamin moisturizer this is the repair mode aha bha night serum 
the Dope Dreams Calming Mist, CBD Calming Mist. The 10 minute we have Green Juice Charcoal Mask. The Total Reboot, which is the enzyme peel. And they have the Dew Hemp Nourishing Face Oil. They're going for about $5.99. $5.99. $3.99 for that one. $4.99. Five ninety-nine. Five ninety-nine. Six ninety-nine. And three ninety-nine. Here we have this bad habit. It's the elderberry vitamin E. It's a lip oil for three ninety-nine. I didn't know they have lip oils. There's also this one, Bad Habit. It's the Eyes Open Caffeine and Peptide Eye Cream for $4.99. We have the Inky List, which was the collab with Selfless by Harem. It's the Retinol and Rainbow Algae Repair Serum. Or for just $7.99. There's another Selfless by Harem. This is the Mandelic Acid and Rice Band. It's an exfoliating serum for only $7.99 with the Inky List. We have the Evian Facial Spray for $7.99. I really like this to like just re-wet my face when I'm doing my skincare and stuff just to make sure everything absorbs good. I really do love it. So I have a bunch of this glossy super glow vitamin C magnesium serum. There's a ton of it <laughs> going for $12.99. You also have the priming moisturizer for um, oil control for oily skin for $12.99. We have a cute little real techniques like ornament sponge for $2.99. They also have the beauty blender, that little gray, it looks like it's a concealer beauty blender for $9.99. This really cute from um, Makeup Revolution and Disney, the Aristocats. This is the Paul Perfect Kabuki brush. And it's shaped like a kitten paw. I don't know if you can see that there, even the colors. It's going for $3.99. This is the first I've seen of this. It's a Benefit Mini in Georgia for $5.99. Looks like that. This is definitely the older packaging, the older, more thicker packaging. But it's exciting to see a Benefit product here. Here is this little Grinch bath bomb. So $4.99. It's so cute. Just seeing this from the body shop. It's their body yogurt and cool daisy. Going for $5.99. They have this from Bedhead. It's the that one step you dry and volume with the big brush for only $29.99. I really do love this. It's so easy and fast to style your hair with one of these. There's a scent from Hemp's I haven't seen in here before. The sandalwood and apple body moisturizer. $12.99 as usual. And more of this Cozy by the Fire by Philosophy. These go for $10.99. I have this cute thing from the Grinch Whipped Body Soulful, which I guess means it's a body cream for $9.99. It says it's cranberry scented. Hmm. So that was super cute because I love the Grinch. Looks like they also have a mini of the Body Shop Cool Daisy Hydrating Body Mess for $4.99 to go with the um body yogurt that I've seen. I have this Care Bears body lotion here too. Strawberry scented. It does really smell good. It's $6.99. It smells really, really good. I also have this from the Grinch. Sweet like Cindy Lou Who body scrubs but they're like little cubes. One for $7.99. This is a fruity scented. Hmm the perfume section now i'm seeing they have this le Mans gourmand oud sahara scent for 12.99 not my cup of tea but it's here they also have the the, the cocoa which i do like this one it's just kind of sweet and powdery and they also have this one the asahi bay which i love these jumbo ones go for 19.99 though because they have the golden s'more scent from the, this uh good scent line for $5.99. This one, this one's called Fallen For You. It's sweet maple syrup, a fig, and toasted pecan. It smells really, really good. To have, still have the candy corn scent, which I really love. 
It's $5.99, which smells just like those candy nuts that you would get at the carnival. That's what it smells like to me. Okay, I'm in the candle section now, checking out all the, see if there's any holiday candles. <laughs> and we have these ones that look like coffee. This is white chocolate mocha. Smells okay. It smells more like hot chocolate. It's going for $9.99. This peppermint hot chocolate, which if you like peppermint, since it's very heavily peppermint, which is a hint of chocolate. Same price as the other one. I have this cinnamon spice latte. Same price. Smells really heavily of like cinnamon sticks, if that's your, if you like it. Here is a white chocolate latte. This one's probably my, one of my favorites. It smells like a latte. $9.99 like all the others. Here we have homemade hot cocoa, which is also $9.99. It smells like hot chocolate. We also have this peppermint mocha one for $9.99, which does smell like a peppermint mocha from Starbucks. <laughs> so if you like that smell, this one's for you. We have this juniper latte, which kind of just smells like a maple type of flavor smell. It's very gourmand, if you like gourmand scents. Uh, this one's my favorite one I've smelled yet, though, I have to say. We are at the Christmas section. What's with the gnomes? Once again, I do think this pillow is kind of cute. And there's a cute little Santa pillow. It's cute. Super cute. Mickey and Minnie. Snow Mickey and Minnie. Salt and pepper shaker. This snowman Mickey again. I really think this is so cute. They also have a Jack, which I think is super cute also for cookies. We have this cute little Grinch mug cake. Has the Grinch on it. Going for $7.99. This is really cute. It says it lights up. Let's see. Oh. I like that. Hmm. Cute as this mug. $9.99. Shrek. <laughs> it's gingy. <laughs> and then we have this one from Oh my god, Santa. I know him, I know him from Elf for $7.99. Very cute. These cute little Christmas tumblers, let it snow. It's a double wall of stainless steel that's supposed to keep your drinks cold for $12.99. Almost missed out on this. Look at the Jack Skeleton. I love that one. They also have Baby Yoda. Some gnomes. Still don't get the gnomes. <laughs> cute little um, peanuts one for $12.99. They also have the Grinch. We have a stitch and another Grinch one. Some cute stuff this holiday season. I'm out of my Marshalls now. <laughs> there was so much Christmas in my Marshalls. So much Christmas. They were even putting out even more Christmas while I was there. But I was just so surprised to see how much Christmas blew up in my stores. I feel like my stores had the most Christmas out of all the stores I went to this week but <clears throat> yeah I don't know if they were getting a head start on it or what there was so much Christmas sets so much uh Christmas in the body care section which I didn't really show it all to you I showed you like the most interesting ones that I found but <clears throat> so much Christmas and I showed you the ones what I thought was the most interesting anyways I did pick up a couple things end up going back for this golden s'mores by the good scent it's marshmallow warm chocolate and toasted graham which does smell like a s'mores i really do get a s'mores scent out of this you can smell heavily the marshmallow and you can just a hint of chocolate and a hint of graham cracker but if you like gourmand scents you would definitely like this scent I think it's great for the fall. What's left of fall, I'll be wearing it, and then I'll just save it for next fall. I was hoping that they would have um, Christmas scents, but I haven't seen any yet. So let's give it a few weeks. <laughs> the other one I got is this by the good scent, the Fallen for You. I could not put it back when um, I smelled this. It's sweet maple syrup, fig, and toasted pecan. And then... <sighs> This just smells like a perfume with like, I don't know. It's mainly a perfume. It smells like sweet fig. 
It has more of a perfumey smell. I don't really get any toasted pecan at all or really maple syrup. But it's not like um, that super syrupy fig. There's another one in there, a fig one. I forget what the name of it is, but it has fig in the name by the good scent. And that one is kind of a syrupy fig. So it's a little too much for me if you don't like fig like that. But this one's really good. This one just smells like a really pretty perfume to me. I definitely recommend y'all smelling this if you see it in your stores. These only go for $5.99. And they just remind me so much of a Bath & Body Works scents for some reason. The packaging and everything just makes me think of Bath & Body Works. But yeah, that's all I got was these two body mist this time. I really think, um, I really like these scents. I even have a couple perfumes from them that I like. I hope that they have like a Christmas collection that's coming to stores because I've really been enjoying it. But yeah, that's all I got today on my video. Take you back to the Marshall sign so I can sign out. So, so I hope you guys enjoyed this look of what's in my TJ Maxx and Marshalls this week. Y'all have to let me know down below in the comments or to the right in the comments because the comments are really they're down below still but if you click on them it takes you to the right but let me know in the comments section what you found in your tj maxx or marshall's this week if you've seen anything that my stores don't have yet i would love to know and yeah you have to let me know i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you liked it please give me a thumbs up down below and if you're not yet subscribed, I would greatly appreciate it if you consider subscribing to my channel. And next to the subscribe button is the bell. You can ring that to be notified of all my future uploads. That way you don't ever miss out on an upload because I really don't have a set schedule here. I just film when I can, when I'm feeling good, when I'm not sick, when my son's in school. <laughs> I just don't really have a set schedule. So it's really important to have that notification bell turned on if you don't want to miss any of my videos. I do try to do these every week, but sometimes there's just not enough content for me to post every week. So <laughs> I'm sure it will be during the holiday season because they're always getting new stuff and a lot of new stuff during the holiday season. It's the best time to go to your TJ Maxx and Marshalls actually. So <laughs> I definitely recommend you start going now and keep going like every week during the holiday season to find all the finds that you do want to find if you're seeing stuff that you want to pick up so anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys next week bye guys